The world is changing. Now we see each other, hear each other, join each other. We live in a time where we can scroll down one page and see our friends, families, life events side by side with conflict, hunger, and people needing our help. We live in a time when we can change, contribute, solve. University of Notre Dame Initiative for Global Development is helping to solve the challenge of limited access to electricity and connectivity for a university in the Democratic Republic of the Congo. Notre Dame is making a difference by providing sustainable solutions to Chumbe University. Solutions that empower people by harnessing the power of solar energy. Chumbe is a city of almost 700,000 people in the remote eastern region of the Democratic Republic of the Congo. Water, sanitation, and electricity are scarce and only intermittently available. Fuel comes in the form of expensive diesel, which must be flown in or brought up river and over land by barge and all-wheel drive. A lack of a reliable energy source to power computers and even reading lamps for after dark present a tremendous obstacle to student achievement. It is not simply the lack of reliable energy that hinders Chumbe students, but also the incredible cost of that energy when it is available. Fuel costs more than $12 per gallon delivered to Chumbe. We have a, a very old uh, generator, which we, we use, but which costs us a lot. The University of Notre Dame, guided by expertise from the Department of Electrical Engineering affiliated with Notre Dame's Energy Center, and with the support of the Notre Dame Initiative for Global Development, is designing, constructing, and installing a solar hybrid microgrid complete with battery storage and diesel backup on the grounds of Chumbe University. Notre Dame is working with local stakeholders to design, deliver, and install the solar hybrid microgrid. Will help empower young people and local people with tools to start small businesses in order to foster economy and to alleviate their sufferings. There is no way you can really promote development without electricity. And this will help our students and the, un the university to be updated with the evolution and the progress of science, education.